Hi guys. Hi guys, just prepping. I was just prepping, uh, making sure I had all the mods, making sure everything works. So far, it looks pretty good. I'm definitely going to need a lot of guidance today. It would be, uh, there's a ton of, uh, Ton of little details for for PM's mods that I don't know if I'm going to be able to to to, uh, to see, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right, I am going to get started. Hello, everyone. Welcome once again to my Twitch session. My name is George Mormisato. I'm the developer of Transcendence, and I've got a series now um, well, called, called Exploring the Expanded Universe, where I download and install and play various mods that uh, players have created over the years. Um, it's It's been a lot of fun because I, I haven't even played probably more than 10% of all the mods out there, um, certainly not to any depth. So it's great just to see uh, the kind of creativity that people have people have gotten. Um, so that that's that's what we're going to do today. Today uh, I've got a bunch of mods from PM. PM is one of uh, old, uh, an old time player who's been around for quite a while and developed uh, quite a collection of really fascinating, really interesting mods. A bunch of utility mods and a bunch of just you know really cool weapon and, and device mods. Um, it's, it's, I'm really looking forward to, to, to playing, playing this stuff. Uh, uh, PM is probably, at least for me, most famous for his Playership Drones mode, um, a mod. Um, that, that's a, a really great mod where you get to essentially uh, play with a bunch of, it turns a whole bunch of ships into player ships and you get to have them follow you around and, and switch between them. That's not, that's something that we're not going to do uh, today. Uh, that, I'm going to save an entire episode just for that because I think there's, there's probably a lot of stuff to, to see in that. So this is essentially um, a bunch of other, a whole bunch of other mods, mostly uh, Drake Technology Industries. That's the one that I think will will do the most. Uh, so we'll, we'll we'll talk about that. Um, all right, let's get started. Let's get started. So I'm going to just do a, a basic, a, a standard vanilla game, but but here are the mods that I'm going to use. Um, I'm in debug mode just so that we can kind of jump around. Um, so I've got I've got kind of the standard mods. These are standard mods that you know usually come come in the game. I've got a debug um, um, mod just to help me so I don't have to um, you know so so I can earn credits and all that and just just get to the good parts quickly. Uh, Drake Technologies Alpha. This is PM's weapons and devices and. Uh, uh, mod. It's got a bunch of stuff that I'm really eager to try out. Um, then, then there's a then there's an auton, auton assembly hanger, which allows you to kind of build build autons. I think this is very similar to the auton bay in the, in Eternity Port, um, but you can get it for free by just downloading this mod. Um, but I think it's got some really interesting features, so I want to try it out and see see if it's see if there's good things I can um, I can learn, uh, particularly for Eternity Port. List demo compatibility, quick or and uh, and the trading post menu. These are I think PM calls these um, uh, quality of life features that that um, he wishes that were in the vanilla game. So these are essentially advertisements for for uh, features that he would love to see in the vanilla game. So we're gonna check them out and see uh, see uh, what we can do. So that sounds that sounds like that sounds pretty cool. Wizard Auton is, an, is a, a special battle auton that lets you use a whole, uh, basically any ammo, any piece of ammo it'll, I believe it'll use, so I'll check out to see what that's like. And finally, a Zen system is um, it's a system, I think, where I get to fight some xenophobes, which is always fun, uh, so I'll definitely do that. Now, the other one I, I'm not going to do in this particular 
uh, right now is Star Castle, which is we'll maybe we'll if we have time at the end of the the episode, I, I'd love to I'd love to try that, love to play that. So we'll see how that goes. All right, let's get started. So I've got all those mods selected. Um. All right, let's see. Um, now, what ship should I start out with? Uh, I've got a lot of weapons, so maybe, you know, I, I, actually, you know what, I'm going to start with a sapphire, because a sapphire, it's just all around, I don't know exactly what I'm going to be installing, so I don't want to have limits on weapons or limits on non-weapons, uh, so unless there's any huge, huge objection, um, let me, let me do it, let me do it, all right. This is all vanilla game. So again, this is just, this is just the Stars of the Pilgrim, the main game. Um, with just uh, all these all these mods added. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do, because I think what we want to do is get to some of these weapons. I want to try to see if we can get some of these weapons as fast as possible. So what I'm going to do very quickly is make my way over to um, St. Catherine's Star. Let's let's do that, because I think that's probably the best place to find some good stuff. I've got, here's my, my debug mod. So we'll just go to St. Catherine's Star. And here we are. Um, I will just do a map, just so I don't have to worry too much. Okay, great. Here's St. Catherine's Star. So let's go. To, let's go to the capital. This is the capital of the Commonwealth. We'll go to the capital, and we will um, see what we can find. Now, now there's supposed to be somewhere. I don't know about here, but I know there will eventually have to be some Drake Industries stations. I just don't know exactly where they'll be, so hopefully, hopefully we'll find them. But I'm pretty sure I can, I can just buy some of these items. So let's, let's go here. Let's, um, let's just check out to see what they've got. Um, okay, none of this looks okay. Let's forget that. Not, nothing. Armor. Let's go for weapons. Let's try some, some laundry. See if there's anything good. Ah, okay. So we already got some, some different racer. L L R M launcher. This is a Drake Technologies weapon. Long range combat. Homer Swarm Buster Mervs. Ooh, that that sounds good. Racer hyper velocity LRMs. WD up to level. That sounds good. Now, one of the things that he's got, and look if you can see on the right, um, this list compatible ammunition. That's a that's one of the features that I think he wishes were in vanilla, which I can totally see makes sense. So now that I can highlight these weapons, let's just try this out. I'm gonna highlight this. And see, it shows me all the set of weapons. This is this is really pretty cool. That are compatible with that. That's that is pretty cool. I do really like that. Super simple. This is using some of the new um, new features in 1.7. I think it's 1.7 where uh, I, maybe not 1.7. Maybe it's 1.6 where we show kind of a little thing of what you've selected. This is great. Um, I mean, of, of the, you know, the launcher. This is the launcher, and these are all the missiles. Um, that's really great. Let me just do this for the other ones. Yeah, so here's the one that shows. This is super helpful. This is super helpful. It, there's, now, he's smart enough. I don't know how much code this took. Maybe it didn't take that much code at all, but he's smart enough to show the disposable missile rack, which really doesn't, doesn't have... Um, it, it comes with built-in ammo doesn't have the list compatible on, which makes sense. That's absolutely the right thing to do, so that's great. So I'm just going to look through this because this looks pretty cool. So the top of the line missile is the is the Fiend cruise missile. High yield thermonuclear cruise missile, blast range of six light seconds. Awesome. So it's, it's just kind of a radius. Um, Homer times three Merv. So this is, this looks like a, that's awesome. Splits into 12 seekers. So this is very much like the um, Medusa, I think, but we'll see. It's a, it's a much lower level, so I think that, that makes it interesting. Racer times three, triple strength racer, blaster hammer, god, so this is like, bla this is just heavy duty blast. WMD 10, yeah, that's that's pretty heavy WMD. Um, and a couple more Mervs, eight seeker micro missiles. Yeah, this is kind of a lower level. These are great, so this is just another, this is, these are again, lower power now. Excel missile. 
massive slug guided by thruster so this is a kinetic it looks really cheap but it does a good amount of damage that's great okay well let's let's um we're here let's install it let's upgrade it oh but of course i can't so now we're gonna do um we're gonna cheat we're gonna give ourselves uh, i don't know a million credits and now we're gonna buy it okay um oh wait do i have enough megawatts yeah I have enough. I'll, I'll, I'll upgrade my i'll upgrade everything let's buy some missiles so this is really cool and now of course the nice thing he's got the reverse if i do this compatible weapons um, i get to see what what launcher i've got um, and that's great so let's buy some of these let's buy um let's just buy these i'm gonna buy um, 100 each well no i don't want to buy that many because i don't i don't know how much it's gonna how much they weigh that's another thing i guess this should say this should this screen should tell you how much this weighs but eh, what can you do yeah that's that's 50 kilograms not cheap okay um those are the mervs these are the triple strength let's buy some of the triple strength we might destroy some stations and those are just merged, so I'm gonna skip those for now. Um, these two, I think, are gonna be interesting. Let's let's play with those two. That's awesome. All right. Now, um, before I go for weapons, let me upgrade my reactor because I don't think I'm gonna survive. Let's let's just do a 100 for now. We're not gonna do anything crazy. We'll do a 100. Okay. Um, now let's let's upgrade our recoilless cannon. Let's see what he's got in terms of other weapons. K-45 Burst Cannon. Three shots, three shot bursts at targets. 23, ah, got it, I love that. Well, we might, I mean, this that's the best weapon they've got here, so we'll have to go someplace, someplace else to find really good weapons, but let's at least get that one, because that's better than the recoilless cannon I've got. All right, and then let's see what else we got in here. Cargo hold expansion, that's just the normal stuff. Do I have any? No drive slots and no other random devices. Okay. Let's refuel the reactor. Let's uh, upgrade our armor, because why not? Um, we'll just go plasteel all around. Okay. Uh, now, while I'm here, let me just... Let me pause and read everybody's everybody's comments just so that I can see. Um, okay. Uh, plenty of non weapon yeah. PM says mainly we've got plenty of non-weapon devices. Ah, the fiend is a double strength. Ah, I see. So so let me just um, This is where I want to list compatible devices too. Yeah, this is where I want to list compatible devices. I have to do. Um, no, I have to do. No, I'm sorry, I can't do it. I can't do it. Because I don't think the fiend is in here. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, yeah, the other thing that I'm looking for are tachyon beamers. That's I, I think those are higher level, um, so we'll definitely do that. Um, we'll definitely do that towards the end of the game. I'll have to. I'm gonna have to ask people how to get it, but we'll see. We'll see. All right. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. This is great. So I've got some good stuff. Um, the other thing I'm gonna have to do is find some. I want. I do want to find some other place to go but let's for now let's go kill some stuff now that we've now that we're armed up i got the k45 burst can't play that i 
love that. Love that. Nice little subtle noise, subtle, uh, subtle sound. Uh, I think that's pretty cool, and I think it's gonna work really well with these guys. Hopefully it's gonna work well. These guys are more powerful than I thought. There you go. Okay, let's let's loose a. Let's loose, look at that! Oh, beautiful! That's so cool. That's so cool. Let's get some fuel rods. This guy also could use some missiles. Actually, let me use uh, let me use the racer. Racer times three. Wow! Look how fast it is. I guess that's the racer part. Super fast. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why, why, why am I dying? Why am I dying? That's not fun. That's not fun. Okay, I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna cheat some more. Uh, I want the other target. There we go. Love it. That's really cool how fast that missile moves. Oh, another wrong. What's that one? Vision display. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, let's. Now we got still some Homer stuff. We'll take these guys out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I about to die? Why am I about to die? I guess my armor is not quite as good as I thought it was. Yeah, I mean, it is just kind of crappy, uh, crappy plasteel. Uh, I'm gonna have to get that armor. And I'm irradiated. Well, that's, that's all. That's all gonna be fine. I get almost a million credits, I think they'll, I think they'll pay to repair me, but not if, not if they kill me first! Bummer. Oh well. That's what I get for that's what I get for going a little too a little too fast, getting a little too cavalier. Okay, now let's I guess we're gonna have to do this again. That's okay, it's a little bit easier now that I know what I want. Alright, get my million credits again. Let me um, let go for my reactor first. Then let me go for um, a launcher. Get that guy. We'll get some missiles. We'll get 50 of those. I like actually like those. Maybe I'll get 100 of those. And then we'll buy 50 of these. Okay. Same, so I can get more, and then I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get this one. I will eventually have to get a much better version of that, but that's okay. Um, and then I'll need to refuel, of course. And then one else. What else did I have to do? I have to. Um, you know what? I'm gonna get some better armor. Let's see if we get some good armor here. S heavy ceramic. I'm looking for blast plate or something. Who's got blast plate? Level six. So heavy satellite might be my best bet so far. Let's see. Let's see what else. What else there is around here? Oh, whatever. Too bad 
bad rear is probably more important, but no one else can get level 6 armor, I don't think. Yeah, that one's got the same. Oh well. I'll, I'll get better armor. Okay. One last thing. Um, All right. Well, uh, I've tried out my weapons. Let's let's keep going. Let's move forward. Um, let's move forward. Oh, let me map. Um, all primordial system. Um, so what I'm going to do... Let me see if... Um, so one thing I'm going to ask... One thing I'm going to ask PM is... Um, I, for, I forgot, is there, 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 is there a station, is there a Drake technology station? And if so, where can I find one? Or Roughly, roughly, what systems are they likely to turn up? Um, like what levels? Then I can then I can find them. Um, uh, that's I think what I that's what I think what I'd like. And then the other question I have is where can I get some of the other technologies like the Auton stuff and the um, the 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 Auton assembly hanger? That's that's the stuff I'd like to try to find. Um, you know, one thing I can do actually. Because this will work with uh, the other the other mod, I should find the trading post. If I can find the trading trading post, let's do that. Let's get all these guys. I'm already like I really need better shields. That's the other problem. I should have bought shields. I'll do that. Hit me, bro. Jeez. Okay, let me find some place to get better shields. There's a Bushida merchant. They will give me some good stuff. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna move deeper in, and we'll find a, we'll find a training post, and then we can order some stuff. as much as I can. How did I get a... Oh, that's just, that just came with it. Uh, can I buy anything good? Oh, well, yeah. Let's buy that. Military ID? Oh. Oh, yeah, I, I have a military ID. good enough. Um, let's see what else. Now, I, I think this guy won't have any Drake technology stuff because I think this is just, yeah, this is Bushido. Okay. Um, what else? Let me look at, let me look at chat just to make sure. Ah, Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. So yeah, I'm going to head towards PM just says, get a trading post. We'll showcase that improvement. Go to mid game stations like Thor. Um, and then, um, that sounds good. And then we'll find some. All right. Let's keep going then. Let's keep going then. 
this is great. I know PM's got to leave pretty soon, um, but this is really cool. It's, it's a lot of fun to play these uh, these new weapons, um, in particular some of the improvements I think are really cool. But let's head towards, let's see if I can find the station. In fact, I can probably um, just cheat a little bit here. Um, I think this is how it is. Um, somewhere here there should be a trading post. Uh, no, that didn't work. Um, oh, there's a Drake Ammo Depot. Is there a Drake? By any chance? No. Ah, there we go. Drake Manufacturing Plant. Drake, yeah, so there's a Drake Manufacturing Plant. Oh, that's pretty cool. And then there's an Ammo Depot. That's great, so I'll have to head towards those. The, the Drake Manufacturing Plants look like they're pretty deep in. So it'll take us a little bit to get there, but there's definitely an ammo depot at in an axis. That's also pretty far, but that's okay. We'll get there. Um, anything else in here? Like I'm still looking for a trading post, but I, unfortunately I can't scroll because I have such a crappy UI. Um, No trading post. That's right. All right, we'll find it. Uh, I'll, uh, I can always check the code. There's a Drake Ammo Depot. Let's check it out. What's this? Is this? Oh, no, that's just a, that's just a normal one. Where are you guys? I do need better weapons. So I mean, hopefully the Drake Ammo Depot has some stuff. Probably just have more missiles. Yeah, I love this missile. Look at that. Love it. Okay, let's go to the Ammo Depot. I definitely need a better weapon. I've got great shields, great armor, but I need better weapons. I presume, well, let's see what it's got. Ooh, Muon Beamer. Here we go. This is some good stuff. It's 40 megawatts. Eh, it's going to come close. I may have to upgrade my reactor. Fire Blast Cannon. Party Cannon. Burster. Raptor Seeker Cannon. Oh, this is great stuff. Side mounted B 45 auto cannons. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. Let's get that. I, I really want a better reactor. Oh, but I still I want I also want a, a, a primary weapon. Armor penetrator. Fire blasts, fragmentation. Let's get this one. Range is adjustable. I don't know what that means exactly. Ha! Huh, that's so cool. That's so cool. So, basically, I can use it to set the range. That is so cool. I love that. That's, so that's a technique that, that we haven't seen, um, or at least is not in vanilla. Um, that's a really cool technique. Okay, I'm gonna go someplace and get better reactors before I blow. Let's just get the 150 and be done with it. 
not done with it because I still need a lot more of it. Sell my wand of wishing. Can't wish for another one. Okay, let's try out this fire blast cannon. Who shall be the who shall be the test target? What poor unsuspecting sovereign? Yeah, and in, in, in chat they're telling me to go for the for the beamer, which I will do. I will eventually do. I, I didn't want to get it because I, I I wanted to upgrade my reactor first, but I will get it. Alright guys, so first we'll start with I think it's set to long range. Whoa! Oh no, wait, I'm not I'm doing the wrong one. That's the one that I want. Wow, look at that. I love the effect on this. It's a great effect. Look at that. The auto cannon, the auto cannon, that side mounted cannon is basically looks like it's swivel, little swivel. Can't quite tell. Okay, let me uh So that's minimum range. I just want to see how this works actually. Yeah, that's great. So basically that's minimum range, it'll just burst right in front of you, which is great for close quarters. And then presumably medium range bursts a little bit further out that's great and long range it just it just goes looks like 50 light seconds or something like that before it bursts you know what i'm gonna set it to i'm gonna set it to medium range because that's probably oh, we'll see we'll see we'll see how it works that's really cool okay now that we've got some stuff let's go back and get the beamer try that one out Ah, so another thing that PM is telling me is there are Drake modules. Let me see if I can buy some of those. I'll probably buy. Nope, not here. But while I'm here, I'm going to buy the Beamer. Okay, let's see what's cool about this Beamer. Ah! Hit scan weapons. Love it. Love, love, love. But it looks like it's got a a recharge, which is fine. That's the I think that's the right trade-off. It's the right balance. Okay, let's hit let's hit some uh This would be good I think for Well we'll see what it's good for. Let's let's hit some stuff. Let's hit the anarchist station and see if see if it's good on hornets. It might not be. That's a lot of fun. Ah, armor repair, why not? Oh, of course. That's okay. We'll keep going. Alright, so with all this firepower... with all this firepower. Oh, who's that? Someone's attacking me, but I can't tell. I like the fire blast cannons. Let's stick with that for a while. 
this is where I want to go to range, maximum range. And maybe uh, slow down a little bit. screen is going to be playing havoc with the with the uh, broadcast I'm sure it's probably hard to uh, that's you know that's essentially random noise so transmitting random noise over a stream session is probably uh, the worst possible thing for compression yeah, all right I love this uh, this fire blast it's really awesome this feels good. Ah, he hit me again. I need a quantum CPU or something to... Well, you're gonna get... this. Did that help? No, it didn't help. There we go. Just uh, keep reading, see if there's anything else that I want to do. Okay, let me pause for a second before I get killed. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So I'm just reading the I'm just reading to make sure. There are Drake modules that boost the fire blast and others. Track for homing, flare for fragmentation, three over for triple shot. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I'll have to do that. I'll have to find those modules. Okay, these guys, who are these guys for hitting me? Don't you know that I've got a fire blast cannon? Oh, more. There we go. Alright, let me find let me find a place to repair and we are. Yep, 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 I know. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm gonna drop my shields just in case. I don't wanna run out. I don't wanna run out of fuel. Repair, repair, repair. Refuel. Excellent. Okay, that's fun. That's a lot of fun. Let's. Uh, we're still on a mission to find um, a trading post. So let's keep going. We're gonna go, keep going to Acheron. Great, great. Here we go. Trading post. 
Okay, so here we get to see another one of these, um, what, another one of the improvements. Let's see how it works. Order items. Press enter to order. Escape the That's something else. That's me. Well, actually, well, let's just try it. Um, Drake. Oh, so this is where I just press, I just press a word and then it shows me all the different things that I can that have that word which is which is beautiful so um, I can say uh, module these are all the different modules I can say um, beamer and these are all the different presumably hit scan weapons oh omnidirectional particle beamer oh that looks that looks pretty cool um, but you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do Particle auto beamer. Whoa, what is that? Let's start with um let's 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 start with the modules. Since uh, PM was telling me that there's something that we can do that. Oh, so this basically just tacks on some enhancements. Razor module, flare module, turbo, boost. Let's do track. Yeah, let's track. Uh, we'll order one of those, please. Track module, 1400 gold pieces. Okay. Yeah, we'll wait. Probably should come right out of that Stargate. But while we're here, let's uh, map everything. See what else is on here. Thor's. There's a weapons corp. Is that the? Ah, it's been arrived. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, thank you. Now I can install it. Let's go to a dry dock. As maneuverability and tracking to shells fired by most Drake matter weapons acquires a multi-target capability when combined with the Drake three-way module. Wow, that is really cool. I don't know how he does that, to be honest. Look at the code, but that's a pretty cool code. All right, let's try it out on. Uh, let's try it on the heliotropes. Come around because I want to avoid the curators. Look at that. Oh, jeez. That is awesome. And it gives it both to my, to my uh, side mounted and to my... and to my primary weapon. That's really cool. But it's not going to work on the beamer because it's only mana weapons. You guys know how terrible I am at aiming. Tracking weapons are like awesome for me. Don't get too close. Repair kits are always good. Fuel's good because I need fuel. Alright. Um, let's go to Thor's and see if there's any other interesting weapons up there. I think PM said that. You might find some here. Let's repair while we're here. Ooh, 10G deflector. This this is a This is a 25 megawatt regen's pretty fast. Only has a hundred hit points versus three 
I mean, it's it's fairly well balanced. It's basically just it trades regeneration for um, hit points, or trades hit points to get regeneration. Um, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, let's see what else we get. Any good upgrades? B45 turret. How many directional B45 turret? Oh, that's nice. Double auto cannon. Whoa. That's basically better than this B45. Double auto cannon. Man, I'm gonna need to upgrade my reactor again, but let's do it. This is another one, Blast Star Howitzer. This is another adjustable range um, fragmentation uh, weapon, which is really cool. DDT-41 Particle Blaster, both particle turrets can track and fire at two different angles. So it's a dual, essentially dual, um, dual turrets. I gotta, I gotta try that. Oh, a mining laser. Oh, I definitely gotta try this. Oh man, I wish I had... Oh, I gotta get a better reactor. Let's go, um... Go to the dry dock, see what they've got. If not, I'll cheat. So I really want some of these weapons. Oh, they don't have anything. Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, oops. Um, let's just go with Hyperion Light. Why screw around? And we'll see if I can. They will install it. They probably will not. No, up to level seven. So that doesn't count. I need a. I think I have to go find a. I have to find a. Oh, black market shipyard. Admittedly, the game is a lot faster when you cheat, but. It's not as much fun, I think. You don't get to see some stuff. Okay, let's go. Upgrade. Yes. Oh no, I don't need to upgrade. I need to replace. Yes. Okay. Um, it's kind of looking good. No. Do these guys have anything good? No, they mostly just have... Oh, they do have a beamer. But that's but mostly just uh, vanilla stuff. Um, smuggler's cargo hold, of course. And fuel to just get all that stuff. Now let's go back and let's... Uh... Oh, here's an Alton place. Okay, so some of these are clearly... Well, maybe not clearly. Yeah, look at that, that's clearly not, that's not a vanilla one. Not, neither is that. Okay, let's buy this one. Just buy one. And uh, let's buy the other one. Let's buy that one. Alright, let's use this, this one first. Okay, so this, wait a second. I think here I'm configuring the Auton. Oh, this is the Wizard Battle Auton. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. So one thing I don't know is whether... Can I recycle the Auton? Let's give it some... Let's give it some of these... Uh... Get some of those. And now what I want, this is where I don't quite know. Let me see. Um, return to ship. Oh, perfect. That's what I wanted. Oh, this is great. That's really cool. 
That's really cool. Okay, well let's that's so that's that's Wizard Auton. That's how it works. I didn't quite know how it works. So you at launch time you choose some ammo to give it to give it and then it uses that ammo. That's pretty cool. Let's battle some curators. Good job, wizard. Earth fossil. Ooh, that sounds good. So much fun. Time is just like flying by, so let me pause for a second and take some more questions or, or just see what people are saying just so that I can follow along. Um, hit scan weapons. Track module reminds me of how the Luzon targeting scanner is. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, a missing device, missing device in uh, I forgot corporate command or attorney port. One of those. Um, yeah, let's check out the Zen. That's that's let's let's do that. Okay, let's let's do that. That's that's a pretty easy. Um, um, So there, it looks like you can see that right between Dantalion and um, LV426, there is a there's a there's a Stargate. So let's go to Dantalion, um, which I forgot is it A9? It's one of those. Nope. Um, A8. Nope. A7. There we go. It was one of those. Dantalion, okay. Okay, now, um, I gotta get way more powerful I'm gonna take on ringers. So let's see, I'm sorry, uh, xenophobes. So let's find, I thought somewhere in here there was a Drake uh, manufacturing plant. Didn't we, didn't we find the Drake manufacturing plant? Where did we find that? There's one in C9, A3, and Gunson. Well, let's go to A3. There we go. So we've seen a lot of Drake tech. We've seen Wizard. We've seen the Trading Post stuff. We've seen the... Um, ammo compat uh, compatibilities we haven't seen ore mining or the Auton assembler we may not have time for that but that's okay 
research lab. Oh, this. Oh, this. There might be whole missions here. Phil, what? My name is Stephen Irwin, lead scientist. You can see we are developing the next generation of military technology. Oh, this is a whole mission tree. This is awesome. Especially interested in technology, antimatter weapons. We hear rumors of slave slavers with new R cannon as one such weapon. If we can acquire one, we can reverse engineer and build a new weapon of our own. That's really cool. So if I turn in the if I turn in the cannon on R cannon. Um, detect the significant sun activity. Oh, I, I probably should have upgraded before I uh, accepted this mission. Yep. Program the coordinates. Oh boy. Okay, I'm not gonna make it. But we're gonna go anyway. This is something, oh, you know what, this is where I probably should just, just go full blow, full bore, um, there's the dragon slaver. Whoa, look at all this stuff. I'm just gonna let loose. Let loose with everything. And of course, even if the dragon slave is already like you know, killing me. Got him. Okay, we'll go back with that. I'm gonna hit these guys. This is of course completely cheating. I mean, I'm using like end game weapons against these poor guys. In fact, I think I've got a. Yeah, I've got an art cannon, so. <laughs> if I can aim. Try not to actually blow them up. Or at least destroy the wreck. There we go. I'm a little bit slow, but that's okay. Yeah, I don't need any of this, but I'm gonna jettison some stuff. Jettison all this stuff because we don't need it right now. Okay, much better. Let's find that dragon slaver. I think that'll have oh where to go. Can long arc cannon. Long two spheres, which we love. Okay, let's go back. That's really cool, so they do a little mission. Did you find the slave star counting it? Yes! Excellent! Unfortunately, the pages say it, it was it was disassembled in order to learn to see that don't worry, our efforts are not going to waste. After all, you cannot make an omelet without breaking a few eggs. Ain't that the truth? We constructed an antimatter chamber in order to can upgrade our positron weapons because we this possible we may have the module free of charge. I love it. No positron weapons in stock. Oh, this is great! And now the now the stage now they continue. Only Rin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. What's going on here? Who's getting who's getting attacked? So they gave me antimatter module. Awesome. And now I need to get a positron weapon. Uh, and where's the outpost? Oh, there's the outpost. This is this is I'm just I'm moving really fast. But I think I can still make it to the Zen. I'm really glad I got to see this mission. This is pretty cool. Okay, uh, it's because those so-called inhumans dominate this system. 
credits are useless. Uh, oh, annoyed by my presence. <laughs> Pardon me. Presume you chased up by my boss, Dr. Lance. He's off in a foul mood. <laughs> I better get back to work for Don Fires me or something. Okay, that sounds good. Um, but I guess I can buy something, right? Uh, maybe let's dock services, weapons. Let's replace our Muon Beamer. That's what I want, that Positon Troni Cannon. Okay, so now I'm sorry, but I'm gonna cheat again. Thousand rings should be enough. Well, how barely enough. Holy criminy. Okay, and then I'm gonna have to let me uninstall some of this stuff. Let's uninstall this. Uh, actually, I want to uninstall that. Can't remove it. Oh, I can't afford it. Remove. Uh, Probably should remove that because that's totally uh oh maybe I shouldn't have. Well whatever, we'll see. Now let's um can I install? Yes, I can install. Yes. Antimatter module. Okay, now, so now I've got a crony cannon. Oh uh, sorry, wrong one. Whoa, whoa, that's awesome. That's awesome, and now it's antimatter. Let's see how I handle this guy. Those guys I took care of. are holding, and I'm aiming poorly, but still, I'm getting it. That's really cool. Okay, almost dead, almost dead, almost dead. Okay, let's let's not waste too much more time. Let's go to back to A7. This is awesome. That was a fun mission. And now we're gonna go to the Zen Stargate. Let's still get enough fuel. Cool. Oh, this is the white dwarf. This is where I gotta be careful, or the white dwarf will suck me in. Deep gravity zone. I just wanna scan around just to see what there is. Here's another, the other Stargate. Stargate was moving. It was just me getting sucked in. Okay, let's go to this star system. I mean, uh, asteroid field. We'll look for stuff. Terraform layer, which I can take out, but not today. Whoa! Don't, 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 don't even. Yeah, it's gonna suck my fuel dry. I don't think I've got any. I don't got any good fuel. Oh, yeah, I can't. None of those good fuel. There you go. Go away. I think the Terravore layers, if I destroy them, I think I will find stuff, but I thought there was something... I thought there was also, um... I'm just gonna have to refuel one of these. Eh, doesn't know very much. I thought there was something... I thought there were xenophobes around here, too.
Oh, there we go. I don't know where all that stuff is. Oh no, that's not what I want. Um, is it Xenophobe or is it Ben and Xenophobe? things. Ah, there it is. Um, uh, let me try. Um, uh, there they are, way out in the middle of nowhere. Okay. I suspect if I destroy the if I destroy the Terravore layers, I don't have enough time to do the mission for real. But if I destroy the Terravore layers, I bet you it'll tell me where the xenophobes are. And here we go, here we go. There's like they're like everywhere. Look at that. There's a world ship. Is there? They're everywhere. That looks like another world ship, if not Mark. Wow. Holy crap. Let's switch to this guy. Now, of course, I'm gonna run out of fuel. I'll use those up in our room. That's about the end anyways. Um, very, very cool. So that was, that's PM's mods. Um, I don't think I got even um, even half of it. There's a, there's a ton more uh, that I didn't get a chance to show. Um, but we got to see some pretty amazing weapons. I really love the two missions that I saw. Um, you know, the, 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 the Drake Manufacturing Lab mission is pretty cool where you get to go hunt down some, some uh, Samsung slavers and um, this this mission I think is a lot of fun. I, like I said, I, I don't think I did it right. I should have gone and taken out some of the Terravore layers first, and they would give me clues to find the xenophobes. Um, but but you know next time next time I'll do that. Um, that's really great. That's really really great. So um, yeah, perfect. Thank you guys for watching. Um, this is a lot of fun. And I'm just going to keep doing it. We're going to continue to, to check out different mods. Um, but thanks very much. Thanks um, especially to PM for uh, for creating these mods. Uh, they're, they're really, really good. And I can't wait. I, 
I probably will end up stealing ideas. Um, I think he intends me to try to take some of those, uh, particularly the quality of life features. Uh, so I, that's, that's definitely great uh, advertising for that. All right. Well, thank you guys very much, and I will uh, talk to you guys next week. All right. Bye. Thanks, everyone. Um, I guess I'll take some questions. Did I peek at the Etherpad at all? Um, uh, yes, yes, I have. I, I've looked at the Etherpad. Um, just, you know, I, I don't remember all the details in it, but um, it's all great questions. So I'm really looking forward to IRC Day. I think it's going to be great. <laughs> question time before proper question time. I know, you know, it's it's just it's always fun to do a, a few of these little questions um, at the end of these sessions. So I'm happy to happy to answer a couple of questions. Posting on Steam re IRC day. Yeah, that's a great idea. I will do that. I think that's a pretty cool. Um, it's good to get some advertising. I think that's that's wonderful. Um, definitely, um, definitely ask some more questions. I, I've been so far in this week and last, last couple weeks I've been working on part two. I've been diligently working on part two. Mostly it's, I'm just doing a lot of engine work. Not very much, um, um, not yet very much on content, but mostly just engine work to prepare for a bunch of the new game mechanics, which so far is going pretty well. Uh, Wolfie, did you see my ticket on recoloring various things on the LRS? Yes, I think that's I think that's a good idea. Um, tickets on memory and larger addresses. Yeah, you know what? I think I really think I kind of commented on on the on one of the tickets. Um, I think 64 bit is probably going to have to be the ultimate answer. Uh, so I think we'll probably we'll probably have to end up doing that. Um, are you streaming for IRC day or is it pure IRC still? You know, I talked with um, T Tech and Adrian about this. Um, I'd love to do streaming. He was, he's gonna, he was gonna set up some type of streaming system. I don't know, um, but uh, if that works out, that'll be great. If not, yeah, I, I don't see a reason why I wouldn't just twitch the whole thing. Um, so if you know, one way or the other, we'll try to do some kind of streaming. I think that'd be great. Um, so that'll be cool. Um, what else? Can we add some non 1.7 mods to the expanded universe streaming later on? I'd love to try fixing this. Oh, sure. Absolutely. A absolutely. I got no problem with that. Yeah. I mean, if, if you want to try out, uh, I, I would love to do that. I'd love to do that. We can add that to the list um, and we can do a 1.6 or whatever. Yeah, I think that's, I think that'd be great. It's absolutely not a problem. Um, Anything else? Um, that's a pretty cool idea. Cool, either cool. I'm not sure what that means, but I suspect it means twi uh, streaming, um, which I think is great. Why not stream? Uh, anything else? Any other? Any other quick questions? I think we're I think we're pretty good for questions. Um, I think we're good. Yeah, yeah, no, I know there's definitely a lag, so that's why that's why it's hard to that's why that's why it is hard. Um, but this is great. Um, we'll I'll answer a whole bunch more questions on IRC, um, and um, I was going to say something else, but now I forgot it. Oh. Um, I thought that was a pretty decent. I thought that was a pretty decent uh, stream. I thought I thought it was fun. I, it's it's great to see a, a lot of weapons. Um, so I think we'll I think we'll definitely have to do uh, do do more of that um, 
sometime. Like, I'd love to try out some of the ore mining, and, and I didn't get a chance to use much of the wizard auton and all that, so I'm definitely going to have to do that some more. Um, all right, so that's about it. I don't think I've learned any books. Oh, having LA. Yeah, you know, the problem with, with um, large address, um, uh, with the large address space stuff is you won't be able to tell until it puts until it puts the code you know high up into an area where the you know the bit 32 is set so um, that's my only worry is that it may seem to work but at some point you may get into a situation where um, point of comparison just fails and I don't know when that's going to happen or where that's my only worry. It may never happen, I just don't know because because it all depends on what the code's doing. Um, I just have to make sure, inspect the code to make sure it's all like handling it correctly and some of it might not be, so anyway. Um, that's about it. Uh, anything else? So it's okay, it says might be better to cheat some more. Yeah, yeah, that's that's fine. And I would I would try cheat I would type God. Galactic Omni device, if I remember correctly. Um, so yeah, I'll, I definitely will have to do that. Okay, well, um, thank you guys again. This is it's always fun for me. So um, I will definitely um, see you guys at IRC this coming Saturday, and I will also see you guys next week. All right, bye bye.